do it. Hey, Mike, 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 Mike. Guess it's... what day it is. Guess what day it is. Home day! Happy hump day, everybody, guys. Hump day also means crafting day. Oh, We are is... crafting. We are doing I home. was thinking something different. You were thinking something different. Nope, we're just crafting. Nothing too exciting. Just some crafting. Just some crafting. We're going to craft. We're going to have some fun. Um, we're going to Dollar Tree craft today, y'all. And I got a cute one for you. A cute one. I think you're going to like this. Sprinkle, sprinkle. Spread the love to all your friends, your brothers, your sisters, your mother, your father, all the people, okay? Your grandbabies, whoever, your neighbors. Spread the love. Invite them in to come hang out with us for a fun night, okay? Um, when it comes through, read it real quick. What am I reading? What am I reading? The text. The text? Oh, Lord. It doesn't show me the text. It just says community. Oh. It doesn't. What did he send, y'all? What did he send him? Just sent out a text message, and I don't know. I, I'm afraid to know what he's... Um, I'm afraid to know what he sent in the text, y'all. Tim sends the text when we go live. Um, <laughs> some of y'all got it. I don't know. You have to tell me what he said. All you do to get a text from us when we go live is just text hello to this phone number, 810-374-0342, and we will send you a text when Elena. we go live, okay? So grab a screenshot real quick. I'm going to put this away. Hello, Miss Debbie. Hello, Miss Veronica. I am good today. I am very good today. Hello, Andrea. Hello, Miss Kathy Butcher. How are you? Miss Becky, how are you today? Um, all right, here it goes. Screenshot, screenshot, screenshot. Get it quick because I'm putting oh, yeah. it away. Hello, Miss Marjorie. Hello, hello. Okay. So, you guys, we're going to craft. We're crafting with some Dollar Tree stuff. Um, Tim just left because... <laughs> um, <laughs> Elena's cooking burgers on the grill right now, okay? Welcome to our she, home. She Welcome to our she, life. She asked me how long. I said, I don't know. Five, six, seven minutes each side. So, what so she, she sets do? the timer for seven minutes. And I can smell them. <laughs> He's like, the, God, you got to, you got to watch them. She's in there blow drying her hair, styling her hair. I don't know, y'all. Hello, Miss uh, Miss Larry Donna Daskins, Miss Patricia Ballard, Miss Kenneth Allison Jack, Miss Karen Hutchinson. How are you? Yes, you caught us live from Ohio. Hello, Miss Leslie. Hello, Miss Jan Goodyear. Um, all right, guys. So we are using. A coffee can, a coffee can. You can use the shorter coffee can too. This is just what we have because um, this man goes through some coffee. So we buy it in the big, big daddy size. You might have the little mama size. That's a little shorter, squattier. You might have the more rounded one. This one is a little more square. You can make it work with whatever you got. Um, this idea was actually given to me. My niece what? sent me a photo of um, something similar to this, but they used a Tide Pod container. So you could use that, use what you have. I didn't have a Tide Pod container, I'm too cheap, okay? I buy the liquid and pour it, I'm too cheap to do the pods, okay? I love the concept and idea, but this girl's cheap when it comes to that stuff. So um, <laughs> so we buy the jugs, but we got the, um, the coffee can, so we're gonna make this work. This is what we're using, okay? We have two hats from Dollar Tree. We have a simple plain hat, and then we got a little more cutesy, okay? But they're both from Dollar Tree. And I have um, this little guy, sorry, I already popped his nose off. I was playing with him to see if he'll work, um, and I already popped him apart. But this little guy from Dollar Tree, we're gonna use his little beard, we're gonna use his little nose, and then I don't know, we'll we'll probably save his hat and make a Christmas tree or something out of, we'll cut his hat off and do something with that, okay? And then I also have a stocking, a little stocking. You'll see what we're gonna use this part for. This is optional. Um, as we go, I'll tell you different variations that you can use for this craft if you don't have these exact, exact items, okay? So, um, just, this is what I'm using though. But tonight, I'm going to send somebody the two hats that I'm using, and I'm going to pop the nose and beard off and send you the nose and beard, um, off of this one as well. So all you got to do is find yourself a little coffee can, um, and I'll send you a part of the material that I'm going to use from the stocking too. So all you need is a coffee can, a Tide Pod, something, yes, whatever that, you got, whatever you got, you can make yourself one too. So sprinkle, sprinkle, okay. spread the love. We'll get these materials to somebody okay because he was too cute i said we got to spread the love and, and let someone else make one of these too so first off we're gonna put this stuff aside put this all aside everything except for the hat 
We got our coffee can. Y'all, this is like so easy. This is one you can do with the grandkids. We are, where you can't set that too far aside because I'm going to need it soon. He took it all and sat Thank on you, the Lenny. other side of him, y'all. Apparently, I got in his space again tonight. He don't like she it when did. I get in his space. I get all up in his space. All in his space, y'all. You're feeling under the weather today, and you're getting a blizzard. Susan, where are you? Shush. Where are you getting a blizzard? Are you, like, up in the mountains somewhere? Where are you, we girl? We don't talk like that. Kathy, we went to Dollar Tree today, too. And I heard some, we got some good news, okay? The rumor mill in our little town. All right, first thing I'm going to do, make sure I do this right. I'm going to flip it upside down. Flip it upside down. I'm going to take my first hat, and I'm going to put it over my... Put it over. Ooh, ooh. Would you see that? Woo, woo. Look at, woo. It's like the Twilight Zone. That's interesting. But that's the bottom, so it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Okay, we're gonna bring it back up like this. And if you have a shorter can, your your flaps are gonna like overlap nicely. You can like pull it up all up over. If you have a real tall can like this, you can just kind of glue it around the edges around the top like this. Okay, so it just depends on how tall your can is or your laundry pod container whatever you're how using how big is okay? your can how big are your cans girlfriend i'm, I'm not okay. going to say what i was going to say no this is <laughs> not going to say what i was going to say this is the normal one right um um yeah mm -hmm. yes okay yes yes um someone was asking about my shirt this is my shirt that i opened last night guys with the cute little necklaces that um the little layering necklaces Aren't they cute? I already had these earrings. These are my Walmart earrings, um, but it all goes good together. Goes good together. I was feeling pretty cute and all put together today. Um, I was feeling good. So, okay. Oh, good Lord. Come on. I, I posted the link. I the Thank link you. Here. Andrea, I am feeling much better today. Oh, Tim is so much better today. He's less cranky today, y'all. Less cranky today. Okay, am, so I'm I grabbing a lot better. my little fingers to protect my fingers. I still, still got a little, it's still a little tender but i feel i feel much better today thank you for asking i'm gonna pull it all up glue it all on glue it all on glue it all on i guess we could use a large can or a milk jug oh it was freezing for kathy on facebook so she came over to youtube you could you you could use you could use a milk jug it might be a little you just have to work with it a little bit differently but you could probably make a milk jug work i bet yeah. if you um yeah a, a round what? can would work, yes. A jar of some sort would work as well. What? Did I do this? Yes, I did this. Yep, I did it the way, okay. So now this has the funky little handle thing. We're going to make sure that's in the back, okay? So this is going to be the front of our gnome here, okay? Front of the gnome. It was a beautiful day today here too, Kathy. It was gorgeous today. The sun is shining. It was relatively warm. It was nice. It was very nice. Um, very nice. Yes, prayers for the Floridians. Y'all, y'all, I haven't heard an update, but my son is down there. My son from Texas, my son Adam is in Florida right now. He is, um, he is, sorry, I just got a text message and it distracted me. I'll have to look at it later. But we, um, um, he's in Florida for like the big World Cup for the paintball industry. And they were posting, they were supposed to give an update today, whether they were canceling or continuing. They're like in Orlando area. So I don't know what's going on. He was oh. there though. He arrived. They were at their house they were staying at oh, as of last night. So I don't know what the situation is. I haven't gotten an update. I need my other stuff, baby. You took all my stuff away. I set my stuff aside and he put it on the other side of the room, y'all. I did not. It was not on the other side of the room. It was in, I, it was in it, it. arm's reach. Okay, so this little, I'm going to show you on this one Ooh, how easily this comes move. apart, okay? So this little guy from Dollar Tree, we're going to use his nose. Look it. Boop, it pops bird. right off. And then his little beard, huh. look at this. It just, it's Dollar Tree cheap. Sometimes Dollar Tree cheap is um, beneficial because it like peels right off. And then you don't need the rest of this, okay? No, so Janice, not I'm not a naughty mailing, gnome. I'm not mailing all this. This isn't a naughty gnome. But not you, the naughty gnome. you never know. You never know. But um, it is a gnome. Okay, so I'm gonna send these to somebody who's hanging out with us tonight. So sprinkle, sprinkle. Oh, Spread geez, them. Marcel. Get rid Her of this knee thing. is no longer attached to anything. 
That's not good, girl. That's not good. That's not good. All right, so this is going to be his little beard. His little beard. His little beard. Okay. okay get ready, guys. I'm going to grab some names here in a second. So we're going to attach. We're going to kind of figure out where. I kind of, I don't want it to like, I don't want to see the gray. So we're just going to kind of lay it, line up where it would look good and line up with the bottom. So, like so. So what I said on the text. What did you say on the text? Was no one wants to miss this craft. <laughs> no one wants to miss no this craft. One. No one. Tim and you can always tell the difference between the text. I think you can. Can y'all? Can you tell the difference between the text that I send and the text that Tim sends? He definitely gets the dad jokes going in his texts. Oh, definitely. It's awesome. He does. Yes. Because it's funny. Because he's a funny guy. He's I'm a, a fun, fun guy. guy. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so we're just hot gluing that on. <laughs> Y'all. I can't, I can't, I can't. Your brother-in-law is in Florida and they are getting ready. Plus my friend oop, showed us a video that the alligators were floating down the road. Ah! That's then awesome. we are getting blizzards here in North Dakota. Oh goodness gracious. Well, North season. Dakota, you guys are getting <laughs> snow like all year round. Right, we're gonna I don't the think you guys a get a summer, do you? <laughs> Yeah, do you really get a summer? Do you? Or is that just always? See, I'm sure. Robin thought it was good. It's pretty good. I'll give it to him. Yeah, it was pretty funny. Pretty funny. He's what? a funny guy. Oh, but it's geez, dancing time. Dance. It's dancing time. And that's a that that's a hat from the Dollar Tree. It's a Dollar Tree hat. Yes, it's it's a it's a it's a Dollar Tree hat. I was gonna put it on, but I'm not going to. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Y'all have seen the Auntie Ant that's had a little too much and had a little too much fun. She's out there dancing with the little child at the wedding and she's holding their arms and spinning them and they're flying all over and they're just like, have no, y'all have seen it, haven't you? Some of you have been that little Auntie Ant. Some of you have done it. <laughs> Some of you have been that Auntie Ant flailing that child all over the place dancing, right? Some of you were the child too. <laughs> yes. Yes. And it's paybacks. Right. All right, so that's where we are so far, guys. So this is the hat that we use. Just a little inexpensive, thinner type hat. No pom-poms or anything fancy is what we used for the base, okay? Okay. And then we put the beard from our little cheesy gnome. Okay, this is what it looked like, y'all. I did get an oh, extra Bonnie. one because I thought we could use it for something else, too. It's, it's I mean, it's cute, we're just going to take it to a whole different level of cuteness with our gnome. He needs an upgrade. That's all I'm going to say. He needs, he needs, he needs a facelift. Even though he doesn't have much of a face, he needs a facelift. Okay? We're giving him a facelift. Okay, okay. You guys. This I is names. Gnome Makeover 101. Okay? We have Wendy Kaput. <laughs> I knew the way. <laughs> what? Is... I knew. I knew it was coming. The way he said that. I knew he was, couldn't hold himself. I'm Poor sorry. Wendy. We love you, Patty Wendy. Patty Campbell, Trudy Wendy. Suters, Barbie Hamilton. I'm going to kick him for you, Wendy. There, I kicked him for you, Wendy. Wendy Kaput. Sandy, Sandy Howell Barnby. No, I don't Patty know. Campbell. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. I don't even know. Sharon Davis. Tammy Ruchek, Deb Bell, Darling Thompson, Tammy Taylor, and Jan Goodyear. I can't with him. I can't. So... Next, we have our 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 our, up, okay. our our little bit better hat, okay? Our cuter hat, okay? Y'all, this craft is coming together so stinking fast, but that's okay. We still got a little bit more to do. We're bringing the hat on. Adjust the hat to where you like it, to where you think it's good. I'm gonna bring it up just a little bit. I gotta turn it this way so I can see it. Get his get them straight. I might kind of trying to decide. I thought about folding the brim up a little bit. Putting a couple of tacks of glue. I'll see. Let me say. Let me say. Let me say. I don't know. Do we? Do you guys like the brim up? This isn't going to be red. We're going to change this, okay? Do you like the brim up, or do we leave it down? I'm bringing it up a little bit. What do you guys think? Hearts for brim. Fold it up. 
thumbs up for brims down like that. So brim down, we would glue it and tack it into place. It's hard to show you. So thumbs up for up or like down, not folded. Thumbs up for not folded, hearts for folded. Hearts for folded. I think I'm leaning towards folded. I think that's the direction. I think I'm leaning towards. Hearts for folded. Thumbs up for down and just kind of squinched up a little bit. I think hearts is getting it, guys. I think the hearts is getting it. I do see quite a few thumbs up, though. Brim up. Watching season five of The Crown. I've never seen that, Mary. Tammy says up. Bridget says up. I see some hearts over on YouTube. Lois says hearts. Kimberly says thumbs up. You could put, if you wanted to weigh it down, like if you were going to put this on your porch or something like that, you could, you could put some rocks in it. You could put some sand in it to act as a weight or even like a door weight. You could put like weigh it down real good because it's a big coffee can. You could really like load it in, throw a brick in it, you know, and use it as like a door stopper. That would be so cute. So cute. So cute. All right. So we're doing, I think, I think the heart's got it. Okay. So we're going to, we're going to fold up his brim a little bit. We're going to put right. a couple little tacks of glue. I don't want to fold it up too much because it has a liner in it. We don't want no one, you don't want to show nobody your liner, okay? Nobody needs to see our, our Wendy, I'm, I, I, I'm sorry. Did you offend Miss Wendy? No, she said she's glad to be part of the fun. I'm glad but you're part I'm, of the fun I, too. I, I hope I did not offend you at all. Listen, if anyone got a funny last name, it's us, okay? People get confused. That's true. People get confused by our last They're like, how do you spell that? And we're like... Just really? like it sounds. Did you go to second grade? Just like you, just like it sounds, and they're like, "Oh, I thought it would be more complicated than that." We're like, "Nope, nope." All right, so I'm just putting some hot glue across here to keep his little, his little brim up, just across the top there. Woo! Put him up so he doesn't roll down. Okay, what did I miss? What'd you miss? What'd you miss? What? What? What'd you miss? I don't know. Why? What do you see? What makes you think you missed something? Is there a comment somewhere? Yeah, somebody said they started talking about the crown. The crown, the crown. I don't know the crown. No, Julie is not a no. troll. Where? Where? Show me. Oh, see if head. Click on it and see where it takes you. Does it let you? Mm -hmm. No, but I am going to. Julie, yeah, well, she could have gotten hacked or something too. Julie, I don't know what you're trying to share, um, but it doesn't show up, so we're gonna hide the comment just in case because we don't know if it's really you. So we're going to hide that comment because we don't know what it is because it, it's not letting us click on it. So we don't take no chances around here. Um, we take no chances. Okay. Okay. All right. Oh. There, his little hat is um, glued up in place. Now we got to work on his nose a little bit, okay? And I'm thinking about maybe adding a little bit something fun to his little hat up here. I haven't decided yet, Okay. But for his nose, I'm going to take some chalk paint. I was just going to use white chalk paint, but I don't have, I, well, I have white chalk paint. It's at the shop. I took it to the shop to use it for a project there today. So, and I didn't bring it home with me. Oh, the crown is a show. Someone said they were watching the crown. And uh, I said, I don't know what that is. Um, okay. And then yeah, so the, she was answering. Yeah. yeah. So I'm using a little bit of chalk paint. The reason I'm using chalk paint is because one, I don't want the red oh, to show uh, through, so we're just kind of hiding that you, red. Not you, Jenny Robillard. Robillard. Hope I said it right. Ooh, this, this is like really dried up and like almost gone, but we're gonna make it work. Um, I don't want the red to show through, and chalk paint sticks well to shiny surfaces like this, so that's why we're using chalk paint as opposed to acrylic paint or anything else. You could spray paint this as well. Cause we're just trying to hide the red. So any light color Hi, Jerry. to cancel out the red so it doesn't show through our fabric. Cause the fabric is pretty thin. Hey, you get, could use burlap too instead of the stocking fabric. Get ready guys, I'm gonna grab some more names here in a second. Oh Lord, this is really thick. Really thick. Wow. I know, it's so thick and I have nowhere to grab onto it. It's thick. It's thick. thick and juicy. Well, we're glad we can make you smile, Shelly. <laughs> oh. I don't even know what that was. was. I don't even know what that was. What, what was? I don't know. Your comment. Thick and juicy. Yes. Yes. 
You'll finish watching later. Well, Crystal, we'll see you later. We will see you later. What's she gonna finish? Is she gonna finish watching The Crown later or us? She, probably us later. She probably had to go. She had to go do wow. something. Probably. She's probably busy. Some people are busy, right? Some people have things going on. Okay, we have okay. Gina Turner. I'm gonna dry this. Jenny Roberts Day, Julie Robillard, Kathy Dickman, Susan Coke Tissett, Sandy Howell Barnby, Debbie. Hello, Miss Colleen. Parkins, Colleen Giblin, Kimberly Buck, Sharon Henson, Jane Goodyear, Nancy Chesser, Kathy Roden, and Pat Woods. Thank you, Miss Deborah, for sprinkling from Alabama. Hey, my sister Sarah's here. Sarah's in the house. Hello, Sarah. Are those burgers about finished now? Kathy's reminding us. How are the burgers doing? How are the burgers doing? What can we do to help with the thick chalk paint? I have one like that as well. Oh. You know, a lot of people have their own methods. Some people will like... Some people put a little bit of water in it and shake it up and just reconstitute it. Um, Thank you, Pam. I, I don't know. Um, you can add a little bit of paint thinner to paint sometimes and shake it up and, and but it's a water paint it base. out. But, but it is a water base, so uh, probably a little splash of water. I mean, listen, at that point, when it's too thick to use, you have nothing to lose, right? So you either don't use it because it's too thick to use, or you try to put a little bit of water in there and mix in it. To lose. And if it works, there you go. You've got some paint you can use. If it doesn't work, you were going to throw it away anyways. You couldn't use it anyways, right? I am a firm believer, though, of um, there is an expiration date on paint. I mean, well, especially once you open it. No, oh, like I feel like so, at some point you just got to let okay, it go. Okay, Ann's got a problem. Here. When it starts having snots and chunks coming out of it, oh, when you're trying to, to squeeze it, there's no turning back. When you have just like a thick, consistent, like this is just consistently thick, that's one thing. But when you got like when thick got chunks, snot. when you got, yeah, when you got thick chunks and you're trying to squeeze it out of a bottle like this and you got like chunks coming out and then thin stuff coming out, it's hard to go back from that. So okay. that's, um, that's what I thought about that. Anne has a dilemma. Anne has a dilemma. Anne, Anne, you got a dilemma. Okay. Um, I'm so torn. My sister wants to talk to me. Dot, dot, dot. But I want to watch y'all. But I think I better watch replay and go call her. Miss y'all. My sis needs me. Y'all are so funny. And we'll be here. We'll be here. We love you. We'll forgive you. We understand. Go talk to your sister. Go 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 be with your sister. I have to call my sister when I'm done here. My sister <laughs> my sister tried calling me. Or she well, she sent me a message right before I hit the live button. And she's like, um, I'll call you in a few minutes. And I said, I'm about to go live. I'll call you as soon as my live's over. And she's like, okay. But I know it's okay. nothing urgent. She doesn't like need me right now. Like it's just, we were gonna touch base. So we were just gonna so, girl chat. Susan asked, chat. can anyone tell me what was wrong with Tim? I was going to Vegas, man, oh man. I am so oh. out of the loop. <laughs> girl, you out of the loop. Girl, okay, first it's off, been a week. That's a lot, that's a, that's, that's, that's a long tree. answer. It is. What's wrong We're with gonna me? explain. This is from Dollar Tree. I'm gonna save this. I love this material on the bottom here. We're gonna use that for something else. But for right now, we're just using Ooh. this top piece of like um, linen. Deb says she found um, distilled water works good. Distilled water. Distilled water. There you go. And we always have distilled water. We do always have to. Ooh, and I got not here, but. Ooh, y'all! I just discovered it's like a little flappy flap up there. So you got like even more. Ooh, we're gonna use that for something. Even if we like cut it in strips and use it on a bow or something like that. Super cute, super cute. So we're gonna save that. I am gonna cut this flap in half though. And I'm gonna send half of it to somebody. Whoever I gift the stuff to Hi, that I'm Tammy. using is gonna get a piece of this so they could, you can cover your nose too. Cover your nose, cover your nose. Yeah, it should be big enough if I cut it right in half. Chalk snot. That's a good one. I know, chalk snot. Y'all you know, have done it where you're like squirting it out and then you get that long, nasty, snotty piece that comes out and you're like, oof, oof. Yeah, that's when yeah. it's time to just consider just letting it go. Just let it go. Let it go. Is, Is your phone charging? Because I feel like it's getting darker. All right. So now I want up? you to see. So if we were to not paint it, you see the red coming through, okay? So that's why we painted it with some chalk paint. 
it kind of hides the red, okay? Be careful. Watch it, YouTube. Tim is plugging you in, y'all. He's plugging well, you in. Well, it's plugged in. I've been shopping all day. Went to Hobby Lobby, Dollar Tree, Target and Dollar Tree. Girl, girl, how you doing? How you're surviving? How's, how's, your, bank, how's your bank account holding up? Yeah, okay, you've been to all those places with charging. all the goodies? Is it? Okay, good. Good. Had to get a new phone. So glad you found us again. I'm glad you did too, Laura. Jan, Jan says, uh, my sister says, oh, crafters are more important than her. Then we laugh. <laughs> well, you know, you know, you know. We can joke about it, uh, but we know. We know you love your sister. Yes. We know you love okay. your sisters out there. Sisters are important. They are. All right, so I'm just oh, holding. Oh, what was your news about Dollar Tree? Oh, yeah, we went to um, Squirrel. There was a um, there was a rumor going on around town, y'all. So half of the rumor was true, the other half not so true. So the rumor was that our Family Dollar store and our Dollar Tree were closing, and they were um, they are moving to the next town over into a combined store. And I was all hacked to the no, heck no, don't take our Dollar Tree away. Like, we have a small enough town. We are limited enough. We like our little Dollar Tree here. And we have a good Dollar Tree. Like, we don't get all the goodies there, but we get, like, it's just very well organized. It's very well stocked. I've seen some pictures of some of y'all's Dollar Trees, okay? I've seen some pictures of them. And they're bad. Like, there's just boxes stacked everywhere. Shelves are a hot mess. Like, our Dollar Tree, they take good care of it. It's very clean, very organized. Oh, yeah. They they're, they're, very they're well good. managed. They do a good job. Um, they're always super friendly. There were a couple that were there in the past that I was just like, um, excuse me, there's people in here shopping. You might want to, like, stop your break out there in the front. Or, or, or don't, you know, that's fine that you do that. But, like, when you got a store full of shoppers. Someone needs to be in the store. Oh, hold on. Sorry. Child was trying to call. Um, someone needs to be in the store, right? Elena! Can you tell her to text Trevor and tell him that we are live? <laughs> if mom don't answer, call dad. Yeah, That's what they do. But we're using live. both their both phones. So the rumor in town. Open your so door. I just wrapped it all in there, oh, tucked it in with some Elena. glue. So now Elena. we have a little no a little nose. I probably could have stretched it. And not had those wrinkles there as much. Yeah, get the wrinkles out. I know. I got some wrinkles there. It's, it's bugging me a little bit. So I'm going to make... Get up there. I'm going to make some little adjustments here. So I don't have as many oh, creases. No. Um, let's see. So that's what the rumor was. But I went to the Dollar Tree today and I asked them. I said, you are not closing, are you? I heard that y'all are moving to the next town over that just closed their Dollar Tree six months ago or so. Well, about a year ago. They closed it right after Christmas. Okay? And I was like, that's not fair. They closed theirs. They can't have ours. That's not fair. So they said, well, it is true that Family Dollar is closing. Well, family Dollar is closing. And they are opening a Family Dollar Dollar Tree combo. Yeah. But they're not taking us. They're going to open a new Dollar Tree Family Dollar combo there um, up in the Marine City. And you, they're going to leave ours alone. So I was happy about that. Give you two guesses that. what our college student wants. Oh, he wants money. I swear I just sent him money. Boy's got to do some more work. He's got to do some more work. Yes. That money. Okay. <laughs> Missy, yes, the, the burgers are off the grill. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Thank you, y'all, keeping us in check with our dinner. Yeah. All right, that's a little bit better. It's still a little wrinkly, but that's okay. I'll kind of tuck but the it, little wrinkly, more wrinkly part up at the top. It, it flared up a little bit. And she got scared, so she pulled everything off. Oh, are they not quite done? <laughs> Some of them are done. We're gonna have twice, twice, twice. twice. They're not baked, but no. twice, um, twice cooked no, burgers. <laughs> twice cooked they're burgers. Medium and up. Okay, oh, they're, they're, that's a cute little. They're at least meal. medium, so. So we are going to. Teresa says going, she needs money too. You can use a big wood bead for this too, which would be super cute. But he's kind of big, and I didn't have any wood beads. You can buy the big balls. <laughs> um. Or you can just Not get, word. or you can just get a nose like this. All right, so I'm gonna line some good so, hot. Okay, get ready, guys. I'm gonna grab some more names here in a second. I think I'm gonna trim a little bit of the hair around this area, though, just because um, <laughs> he needs a. <laughs> a 
little manscaping is gonna be happening here. We can't have too much hair around there. A little nose trimming. We're just trimming some nose hairs here. That's all we're doing, nose hairs. I'm not using a ball, I'm using a nose. <laughs> Oh, you guys, you guys, it always comes out the wrong way and then the fifth grade school boy has to come out. Oh my gosh, I'm telling you. What? I just wanna trim it up a little bit so that the hot glue, um, so we can get in there good with the hot glue, okay? And, and we know that the nose is gonna stay in place a little bit because if you glue right on all this loose hair, you're gonna, you're gonna. <laughs> Some gnome scaping? If you, um, if you glue on the loose hairs, it might sag a little and we don't, want it to sag you don't want a saggy nose we don't want a saggy nose okay we gotta have perky nose okay the nose needs to stay where the nose is supposed to be so trim your hairs around your nose okay <laughs> a little gnome scaping here gnome scaping okay all right christy is the real naughty gnome yeah so maybe our gnome is a little naughty after all <laughs> we didn't intend to make a naughty gnome i know right jan um, but maybe he is a okay. little i'm like gonna like put the glue i'm gonna be generous with the glue because i want to make sure he stays okay get up around the oh that glue is steamy y'all see that steam holy moly watch the fingers wowzers 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 <sighs> All right, get up in there. Um, oh, I'm getting some names here. I'm gonna hold that in place for a minute and then we're gonna kind of glue the brim of the hat on the top of the nose. We okay? have Kelly Damron. Deborah, we're making a coffee can gnome. Sorry. Gina Turner, Cheryl McKinney, <laughs> Connie Nicholson, Deborah Griffith Randolph, Kathy Bircher, Butcher. <laughs> Teresa, Teresa, yes, hot balls. Judy Elsenbeck, <laughs> Amy Humphreys, Y'all can't yeah, tell me you weren't thinking it too, okay? Michelle Johnson, <laughs> Sharon Henson, Dorothy Kootner, Teresa Matheson, Jen Goodyear, and Crystal Foster. So you can make this with the kids, but you might not want to watch the video with the kids. Unless you got some fifth grade school boys, then they're going to love it. They're going to love it. They're going to be like giggling and have all the jokes. Okay. All right. Oh, yeah, I'm going to glue. Bad, I'll answer my own question. I'm going to glue the nose there a little bit hold on hold on gotta get a good little adjustment well kayla here. um it looks like hooked on phonics worked for who for me no for her. Oh. the way she spelled question then she put oh. question lol can't spell oh. <laughs> i can't spell either girl i can't spell hooked on either. phonics y'all that nose is so cute so cute so cute so cute and get his beard out, you guys. I don't know. I was going to add a little something extra to the hat and thought maybe he'd need something, but I think he's kind of simple and I think he's just adorable. Y'all, look how cute he is. Isn't he cute? I mean, you could add extra. I don't know. I don't know. I was thinking like a little, like something, a little something to the hat. You could also like make his hat ball. Oh, that's kind of cute. Desi says, all my grandkids are fifth grade school boys. Should we do a little fluffy ball hat? Or should we so leave everybody that? Everybody loves a little fluffy ball. Everyone loves... <laughs> a little... <laughs> I'm not going to say anything. You guys, heart if you think we should, because I have two more of these, okay? I have two more, okay? So I still got plenty to send to our lucky person who's hanging out. So hearts, hearts if you think we should leave it like this... Thumbs up Probably. if you think we should um, wrap it in the white and make it a little, a little, a little fluff ball, ball on top. Uh, That's Karen kind says of fun. yes, fluff ball. Sharon says leave it. And say yes, wrap it. Oh. I think I said hearts for leave it, thumbs up for fluff ball it. Hearts for leave it, thumbs up for the fluff ball. <laughs> I keep trying to call it Harry, but I'm not going to. <laughs> I think I just snorted. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Hearts or thumbs up? Bring them again. Bring them again, because I'm. Tammy gonna... says she's laughing so hard she can't see her computer to work. <laughs> That's what you get for watching at work. <laughs> I don't know, Tim. What do you think? Do hearts or thumbs got it? I felt like hearts had it, but then I, think... I feel like thumbs is coming in for the win. I think thumbs is. I think it's leaning towards. What do you think? I don't know. We're going to wrap it. That way you know how to wrap it if you want to wrap it, okay? Oh, well, yeah. You so I'm still going to, so I'll end up sending 
two of these pieces to... <laughs> Looks He's like worse Phyllis than Diller. me. He's worse than me. He's, I don't know, who, who's Phyllis Diller? Oh my God. I know, y'all. I know. I should probably know that. I know I should probably know that, but I it don't. It doesn't know surprise that. me you don't. Okay. So I got to figure a, out how She's a gonna... comedian. Oh, okay. Much like Don Rickles. Kind of an insult comedian. Who's Don Rickles? Okay. So I'm going to kind of figure this out. We're going to kind of like make like a circle. So I'm going to bring all the. I got, <laughs> Back comb your hair, because we don't want to cut off our edges of our hair. So we're going to back comb our hair. I know, right, Gina? And we're going to cut like a circle. We're going to create a circle here, and we're just going to... We're going to Michelle wrap says, wrap that puppy. Wrap that baby up. Wrap it up. Okay, we're going to wrap it up. We're just going to cut like a circle of fabric. Yeah, we used one of the big plastic uh, uh, Folgers cans. Yep, this is the, the big, tall, big daddy plastic Folgers can. Well, thank you, Jeannie. She says you two are so cute. She's Amish. She's got the Amish beard. Oh, oh yeah, I got one side in. Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> I was trying to be a gnome. Oh, wait, I got to do this to be a gnome. Ah, it's too furry. Whew, I don't know how people wear beards. I don't know how they do it. I don't know. I don't, do I. Oh, I'm like eating the hair now. <laughs> it stays attached. <laughs> it's like sticking to my lip gloss. Mostly. Yeah, this doesn't stay attached. It's like in my nose. It's on my lips. Oh my gosh. Yes, all. we're still talking about the gnome. Okay. Guy and Amanda. I'm going to be like eating hair for the rest of the night. I feel it there still. Ugh. Okay. <laughs> Pam says, don't send the one that you just bent over Tim's head. <laughs> You'll never know. You'll never know. All right, so we'll start here. I'm just kind of figuring out the best way to... Okay, so we're going to start here. Okay, here we go. It's going to start on the front. I'm going to get a glue finger ready because... A protective finger ready because... I'm going to be all up in there with my glue. All up in there. Okay. So we're just going around the base of the ball. Coming in with the bottom edge. Tucking it in there. Tucking it in. Tuck it in. Maybe stuff the hat a tad to fluff it. Yeah, I bet oh, that would could. work. Uh, a a milk jug me. would probably work. Yeah, I think somebody fluffing. suggested a milk yeah. jug, and I think the milk jug actually would be a good shape for this. It would actually fill in that hat a little bit. Yes. All right, we'll put a hot glue on the back. It's a great idea for a door stopper. Yes, that's what we were saying. We could put add rocks and or stick a brick in it or add some rocks to it. Um, add some rocks to it, add some sand in it, and it'd weigh it down for a door stopper. It would be awesome. Well, the hair of a beard is different than that of a fluffy ball. I don't know who said that. Who said that? You, um, I, you deserve credit for that one. Because <laughs> it wasn't me. I didn't say it. Amanda. 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 What did you do? I used... <laughs> I had some excess glue I had to get off, and I used your pen. I see that. <laughs> Sorry. All right, we're going to get the sides. I'm going to... Tuck that in there. Get it all up in there. And you guys, tomorrow, tomorrow, make sure you are on our texting list, okay? Make sure you're on our texting list because tomorrow we have a big tomorrow, announcement. Tomorrow, tomorrow, we'll tell you tomorrow you're only a day away. We have a big announcement tomorrow. We are annou officially announcing... What are we announcing? Oh, I had hair. <laughs> I had gnome hair in my mouth. Um, we are officially announcing really? is there something you need to tell me? our store opening day, guys. We have officially locked in a date. Locked in a date. We have um, a special reveal date for family and friends. And our subscription group, our craft kit group, gets um, special access, early access to the store. Um, 
and but we have officially have our open to the public date for our store you're not going to want to miss it so we're going to announce that tomorrow so make sure you're on our texting list tim can hold up the um the number for you in a second here in case you are not on our list just text hello and that'll get you going on our list to 810 yes i was gonna have you hold it up 810-374-0342. Text hello. Text hello. hello. That'll put you on our texting list. We'll send text messages when we go live. Um, and you will know. Hello. You will know there was when we go live to make our big announcement. And when we go live to craft. All right. This is, I think, the last little spot to glue in. You might be able to find a little hat that has a little white pom-pom too. Now, if you can't find um, these little gnomes that have the little beards that I'm using, you can go to the craft store and you can get the little um, fur material, the little white fur material, and you can... Um, I'm just going to hold that one spot. Hold on, one more little spot. You can um, just cut it into a beard shape. Or there was another thing that I happened to have here, and I saw what do you it. Have? I saw it when I was getting ready, and I thought this could work too. And I'll show you. Hold on. Okay. The um, where did I put it? Where did I put it? Hold on, y'all. Oh, there it is. It's. I don't think it'd be as cute as this. Sorry, I glued my silicone finger to the pom pom. Um. It would be a good improvise if you couldn't find any other furry stuff. But this is like the little mop, the little mop accessory oh, wow. at Dollar Tree. It's kind of like furry. I think, I feel like you could make that work as well. Oh, yeah. You could totally make that work. So you probably need two of them, one for the beard and then one for the pom-pom if you want the pom-pom. And everything, everything except for the coffee can is from Dollar Tree. Yes, all from Dollar Tree. All from Dollar Tree. All right. I'm going to stuff a little stuffing in his hat, though. I am gonna stuff a little bit of you guys, how cute. I do feel like we need just a little bit of fluffiness. So I'm gonna grab. I know, right, Trudy? That's that's about the only time people call is is when you're in the middle of something. Did Elena take that polyfill the other night? What did she do with it? I don't know. She couldn't use it. Oh, here it is. I got it. I got no clue what that girl does. Elena wanted to use my polyfill the other night, and I'm like, I this all I have left. You can't use it because I might need it. So see. See, I glued the front of his hat, but I didn't glue the back. So I can kind of grab hold of this, go in from the back side, wiggle that it up the there. The gnome is a, um, it's like the big Folgers plastic coffee can. Yep. And you can use the shorter ones too. I, I, I really think you could use a milk jug. A milk jug I think would work as well. There we go. It makes his hat a little, a little fluffier, shape him a little bit. Oh, how cute. He's got a dirty beard. Hold on. He's got a fuzz in there. Okay, guys. What do you think? Get that out of the way. Oops, just throw that over there. Oh, how cute is he? He's oh. adorable. I feel like he would even make a cute little gift. Charmaine says I feel like that's totally giftable. Old, old pillows for Phil. Ooh, yes, yes, yes. Even like Dollar Tree, like if you're in a pinch and you need some polyfill and you don't have any old pillows, you don't have any old anything to steal something from you've got the little they so a lot of times they'll have those little square pillows you can get that for a dollar dollar 25 and Lock cut the cut for. the cut the fluff out of that or like the stuffed animals that they have there if you're in a pinch um you can make it work but you guys i'm glad we covered his hat his little hat okay. pom-pom y'all um, this is cute okay let me cover the name here yeah okay well that's that's the one, that No. We used the more square one. This is the more round oh, one, but okay. it's the same size. So so it just goes to show you could use the round one. You could use the square one. It doesn't matter. This one has, like, the handle for, see, there's the shape. The bottom, it's got the little handle. But you just tuck your handle in the back, okay, and nobody's going to know. He's got a little bit of a square bottom. They're going to know. But that's okay. No one's going to see that part. They're going to see the front part. They're going to know. And how cute he is. How cute. How cute, you guys. I love it. That was so simple, so easy, so simple. Um, like you could whip a bunch of these up in no time. Call your family and friends, tell them to start saving you your coffee, their coffee cans. Y'all know 
most everyone's gonna go through at least one, maybe two coffee cans between now and Christmas. So call up your friends, tell them, I need your coffee cans, okay? Um, but we're gonna gift, we're gonna gift. We're gonna gift? We're gonna gift. We're giving something away. We're gonna gift, I'm gonna set that over there. Woo -hoo! That. We're gonna gift. Oh, where'd the other hat go? Uh oh, here it is. Sure. Okay, so both hats Very that fun. I used, I got extras because I knew I was going to gift them. So we're going to gift these two hats. We're going to gift the little square of fabric that I used for the nose. Just because I don't have a box that these will fit in. I'm going to go ahead and pull these apart for you. So you've got your beard. You don't need the extra nose. But here's another beard, so you can do the pom pom. Oh, wow. Chances okay? they're closing schools for the blizzard. There you go. Oh wow! Wow. Yeah, I oh. think we'll get some bonus names. Wow. Well, that sounds good, Janice. All right, y'all. We're gonna gift this to somebody. Tim's gonna get some bonus names, and then we're gonna pick a name to gift this stuff to. Okay. Um, and if you guys make this, y'all, make sure you um, post it in our craft sharing group so we can see it. Also, and put hashtag or Christy Inspired at Christie's Craft Room. Duh. Tag us at Christie's Craft Room. I don't know what I'm saying, y'all. Okay. Um, we have Eileen Olson, Gladys Salabi. Yes, Pam, you could. Janine Webster, Pam Age, Jenny Roberts Day, Stephanie Stewart, Corby Slocum, Sandy Howell Barnby, Kathy Wolf Andick, Tammy Garrett, Jeanette Wadsworth, Tammy Boda. Sue Downing, Catherine Dessels, Don Marie Bayhill, and Pat Woods. All right, so if you just heard your name, that means you're in our crafty mail bucket. At the beginning of the month, we will pick two names out of the bucket and give some crafty mail too. Um, if you are new here and this is your first time or you, you've only seen us a couple times and you haven't done this yet, make sure you click on our name where it says Christie's Craft Room and follow us if you want to see more crafts like this and other fun things um, from our page. So... Don't forget to do that because that way Facebook will, if you want to see more, Facebook will know, hey, they want to see more. We'll see show more. them more. So, we'll yep. see more. See more. See more. So, all right. You ready? Under the bleachers. We're going to we're gonna scroll C through and we're going to pick some names, okay? Or pick a name. Pick to a name. To. A name. You ready? Yep. Ready? You guys sing it with me. With scrolling, us. Scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. Keep those names a rolling. Scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. A winner. Scrolling, scrolling, scrolling. Keep those names a rolling. Stop. <laughs> In the name of the... Watch, always thinks I'm talking to her. Always thinks I'm talking to her. Always. I'm like... I that woman got a problem. I know. She thinks it's all about her. All right, he's writing it on a sticky note, and he's going to pass it over to me. Sticky note, please. Sticky note, please. Who's going to get this pile of stuff? And if you didn't get who's it, gonna get this pile of who's going to get the pile of stuff? The pile of stuff. Um, but it's all from Dollar Tree, okay? It's all from Dollar Tree, so you can get um, it as well if you did not get your it name drawn. Well. But we have Miss Miss Tammy Taylor. Tammy Taylor. Miss Tammy Taylor, send me a private message to the Facebook page. Just Come on over to Facebook, Christie's Craft Room, or click on my name here on the live, and um, it'll take you to my page. You click the message button and just send me a private message with your address, and we will send this little pile of goodies to you, okay? So you too, you just need to get yourself a little coffee can or a milk jug or a Tide Pod or a pod. It doesn't have to be Tide. It could be whatever pod. It could be Gain or whatever soaps and suds whatever i don't know whatever brand you use. i don't suds. know i don't even know whatever brands are out there you're, um, you're grasping at straws now aren't you I don't know. um but you can make your own little gnome with all these little accessories you just need your jug okay and some hot glue yes everybody needs yes. jugs yeah. <laughs> all right y'all as we digress um we're gonna go eat those um twice baked burgers that elena so great cooked for us <laughs> so um y'all thanks for hanging out this was a super quick craft super quick and easy but i think it was super super cute well, and i think it was amazing quick. so maybe it wasn't it felt super quick because we we're having so much fun well, so, but sprinkle. oh well i guess it wasn't that quick but we had fun so sprinkle this to your friends if you haven't yet um because i think other people might like it and want to make this too so we love you guys and we'll see you guys later okay
It feels like the subscription group today, Tammy says. I know, girl. I know. I know. We got a little naughty in here today with our little... Well, we still gnomes tend to do that. Not Gnomes bring the naughtiness out Yes. Us. They do. Gnomes... It's all the gnomes' fault. It's, it's his fault. The gnomes are naughty, and they 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 corrupt us. So that's why yep. we don't make, can't make too many of them. <laughs> it's the gnomes' fault. All right. We love you guys. We'll see you later. You guys have a great night.